In this video, I'll give you our best free intro templates for Premiere Pro. Now you get the game intro template, the BlueFX logo intro, as well as the Fire Titles intro. Now we don't charge for these templates, so you can just go ahead and download them and use them for free. If you'd like to take this video and share this YouTube video on your social media channels, that would help us out a lot. And I would be forever grateful if you did that. So let's go ahead and edit this template inside Premiere Pro together. And you can find the download link directly in the description box. Just select all of the files and drag them to Premiere Pro into the project panel. Now deselect the files and click on the base file. Drag it to your timeline. Next I'm gonna add on top of this the reveal track but I'm gonna leave two spaces here, two tracks free because there will be my text. Okay, now we can add also our base loop in continuation of our base and also our upper loop at the top of the base loop. And that's it. Now we have our animation set up. All we got to do at this point is to add our text. And to do that, just go to graphics, new layer, text. Now I'm going to take this text layer and just drag it down here. Let's change the color. I want this color to be white and scale this up and you can make it all caps it looks cooler like this now i'm gonna add another text go to graphics new layer text i'm gonna position this one to the top and scale this down position it and i want to have this a different color to select a color i'm gonna click on fill and i'm gonna use the and i'm gonna use this blue color because i like it very much Okay, now, as you can see, the second text needs to sit here at this point. Now, the next part is to take a look at how this looks. And as you see, the text disappears at this point. So, at this point, what I want you to do is select both text layers and just trim them until this point. Okay, and now you see the animation is happening but I want to make sure that I extend the duration of the text layers. And now our animation is done. Now if you want to, you can add an image or even a video in the background. So I'm going to just select all of these layers and just push them one track or two up. So we have here a free track. I'm going to just take an image and just put that image as a background layer here. And we're done. Now at this point you could add also a different video or any type of different image in the background and you're done. Now if you already like this video, click the like button because that helps our channel a lot. So now let's edit our next template, the BlueFX logo intro. Now this template works well for any type of video intro. So first I'm just gonna drag and drop all of these files into Premiere Pro into the project panel. Then I'm gonna just go ahead and deselect these files and then I'm gonna start with the background image. So I will take the background image and drag it to the timeline. I'm gonna extend this and next I'm gonna choose my favorite color. I'm gonna use the blue color here and I'm just gonna drag this to the timeline leaving one track open. Next I'm gonna add my logo. You can use your own logo or you can just add a text. The animation is covering most of the screen and this is the point where I will cut the logo. Now you see that the logo is still hanging out so what I want to do is I'm gonna select my logo and I just want to scale this down so that the logo is not visible. And that's about right. Next we're gonna add our lens flare so click on the logo 16 lens drag it here at the beginning of the timeline. Now you see this is black at the moment, so for that to change, select it, click on opacity, twirl it down and click on blending modes. Now on blending modes, you want to select the screen option. Okay, as you can see, the lens flare is showing up properly. Now we can also add a text effect that will show our website. So I go to graphics, text, new layer and click.
perfect that's all you got to do to make your logo animation in Premiere Pro with this template I'm gonna click on the selection tool drag this underneath my logo and call it your website is here or whatever you want to call it now let me show you where to add this text you see at the end towards the end of the animation to, on this track you see this little bump and this bump is actually a sound effect as you can hear a little bell now I want this to start when the bells start to make a quick simple animation all you got to do is fade this in and in Premiere Pro if you hold down Control D and it already gives you a, a dissolve effect and let's take a look all you need to do is just right click here and clear the second dissolve and let's see how this looks okay now let me show you my favorite free intro video template for Premiere Pro this is my number one pick it's called the free fire titles intro editing is super easy so we're gonna just import all files to Premiere Pro and I'm gonna just add the base here we're gonna start with the base then we're gonna also add the base loop next we're gonna add our first text layer let's add a text new text now let's add another text and of course we can change our text so now let's just add over this layer our reveal and also our upper loop like this okay one more step you want to cut the text exactly where the text disappears like this we just trim it extend the text at the till the end of the composition and we're done take a look within a couple of seconds we were able to edit this template and it's super easy to follow along and just do these three steps okay so now you know how to edit all of these templates they are super easy to edit and they're super versatile now if you want to see how i make an animated doodle video inside premiere pro check out this video and if you want to see how i edit another cool video template and how we make a cool new template animation check out this one right here Check it out, this one or this one.